Hello, 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 and a very good morning to you. Another glorious sunny day. I hope you're having a lovely Sunday so far. It's fun day Sunday. Time to chill, time to relax. What a beautiful weekend it is to do. So welcome to our next day. It's day five today. We're on the digestive system today. I hope you're digging it. Uh, the digestive system is a huge system, of course. I'm going to outline a little bit about the digestive system, a little bit about the metaphysics of the emotions of the digestive system for you this morning. And take three, because I've already tried to record this three times. I'm going to try and guide you through a beautiful meditation Fingers crossed. Mercury's in retrograde, so things are a little bit um, arrive when it comes to communications at such times, as you've probably noticed in your own life. Um, that's what's behind it. We're more than halfway through it, thank goodness. Thank heaven for that. Um, but it is always a time to kind of pause, reflect, reanalyze, rethink, regroup, all the rewords, breaky, you know, what we're doing here as well. Uh, all those words apply at this moment. It's 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 not a time for moving forward. It's a time for contemplating. And Mercury is the kind of chat, the planet of communication. So that's why communications may be more difficult at this time. We'll say one way or another. Uh, anyways, good morning. Welcome. I hope you're having a good day, and um, I hope this is really really helping you. The digestive system is a huge system. It's made up of lots of different organs. It's actually an organ system uh, rather than just an organ or a system itself. It's comprised of many different organs. For example, we've got the mouth, we've got the stomach, we've got the liver, yeah. Uh, we've got the small and large intestine, the ileum, the jejunum, the colon. We've got the spleen, we've got the gallbladder, We've got the we've got so many components to our digestive system. It's huge. It's everything that allows us to absorb life. The digestive system. Um, I would say if there was a chakra that really regulates your digestive system or shows you where you're at with your digestive system, it's the solar plexus where your rib cage meets at the beginning of your chest. So, before we get into all the details of it, I invite you just now just to relax for a moment. Let's take some deep breaths together and relax the body, close the eyes if possible, and I invite you to relax your tummy and breathe softly and deeply into your tummy until you feel your tummy expand with the in-breath. Pause the breath for a moment, and as you release the breath through your mouth, allow all the muscles of your body to let go, and allow yourself to feel truly supported by the chair or wherever you are at this moment now. Take in another slow deep breath into your tummy. Pause in the breath and enjoy releasing that breath, allowing your body to release any tension, any stress, any pent up emotions or energies with the out breath. Relaxing your tummy and breathing deep into your center once more. And as you exhale, just imagine just now that you're sending your roots down through your feet all the way down into Mother. This beautiful Sunday morning, down into Gaia, through the soil. Imagine your roots growing down through heart of soils, rocks of the earth, the minerals, the elements, all the layers of the earth. Imagine your roots are growing all the way into the heart of Mother Earth, connecting with an anchor. Any, sh any shape, any colour, it could be crystal anchor right at the centre of the air. And imagine your roots just now are entwining around that anchor. And I invite you to take a few breaths where you're breathing in through your roots and we're pulling the earth energy up into our body with each breath. Just like a great tree. Imagine that you're a tree right now. And as you breathe, you're breathing in through your roots and you're pulling all this chi, all this wonderful earthly grounding centre of energy up into your body. And you may feel that flow into your feet. It may feel a little bit tingly. It may feel a little bit cool or viscous. Sometimes it feels warm. Uh, but you'll feel some kind of energetic change as you connect with the earth just now. And you really mindfully breathe the energy from the centre of the earth up into your body. And allowing it just to gently flow up your legs. 
allowing your legs to relax, your knees to soften. Feel that energy being pulled up into your thighs and just allow your thighs to relax. Breathe into any tension, any discomfort. And feel the energy flowing into your thigh bones for a little bit of extra support this morning. As you continue to breathe in through your roots, imagine you're pulling that energy now up into your hips. Allow your hips to relax and soften. And imagine the energy flowing into the base of your spine, opening your base chakra. You may imagine something beautiful and red at this moment, like a beautiful berry in autumn. And as your base chakra opens, just imagine as you're breathing in through your roots that the energy now is flowing from the base chakra all the way up through the spine, all the way up through the vertebrae, all the way up through the chakras, opening all your chakras one by one, the sacral chakra, Solar plexus, heart chakra, throat chakra, brow chakra, and your crown. That's beautiful. Let's take one more deep breath, pulling that earth energy from deep below, all the way up through the chakras, through our body, all the way up to your crown. And just imagine that energy now flowing out your crown like a fountain of energy. To surround your body in a few beautiful bubble of energy. Excuse my little waspy friend here. Imagine that you're rising gently in your bubble of energy up to the roof, up through the ceiling, above your home, above your town, up into the blue sky, the deep blue sky on this beautiful Sunday. Imagine that you're going beyond any clouds, should there be any, way up high. And you're traveling up through the universe, through the stars, as they whiz by you just now, darker skies with less stars. Imagine that you're going up through more bright, starry skies. And now imagining yourself going up through a purple hue. And now a golden hue, a golden mist. Imagine yourself going up through some jelly like substance. And now imagine yourself going up through a skylight above your head just now. A beautiful pearly iridescent white light. Imagine yourself traveling to the center of that light just now. And just allowing you to be one with this energy of peace and love on a Sunday morning. Allowing you to enjoy this energy and receive a little healing while you're in this space just now. Enjoy everyone. Thank you. beautiful and just imagine that you're bringing some of this energy back home with you in your beautiful bubble of light and we're going to make the intention today that our digestive system heals with the ease and with grace and in your beautiful bubble of light just imagine yourself falling back down through that jelly light substance back into the universe imagine that you're traveling down through those bright starry skies the dark skies, the bright starry skies, and imagine that you can see the beautiful blue planet on the horizon with her magnificent sceneries and landscapes. The beautiful snow-capped mountains, forests, the beautiful oceans and seas, all the colours and all the delights of nature. Imagine that you're coming down way through any clouds up high into the crisp blue sky. Imagine yourself to be coming back down into this space. Feeling the contact between your body and whatever may be supporting you at this time. And before you open your eyes, I suggest and highly recommend that you take another deep breath. 
And with the out breath, just imagine that you're sending all your energy down through your roots once more, through all the layers of the earth, into the heart of Mother Earth. And take a, a couple of deep breaths, a few deep breaths, pulling that earth energy back up into your body, feeling it flow automatically with the breath. Feeling that energy from the earth flow to every cell of your body, all cleansed, all refreshed, all re-energized, all ready for a new day, a new beginning, or a fresh start into your day and whatever you're doing. Take a little moment to have a little stretch, wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingers, have a big stretch up there, let your fingers touch the sky, oh, stretch them really high, and give your legs a little stretch as well, working those muscles of the legs, stretching them out, of course we're always releasing when we stretch, and if you can have a nice big yawn, that's magnificent, hello and welcome. Okay, so I'm just going to quickly talk you through the digestive system. Huge system, as we said. It starts off with the mouth. We've got the stomach. And we've got that leading into the intestine, the gallbladder. We've got the spleen and all the organs that we mentioned before. That it's a huge, big organ system. So a lot of work is going to be done today. Um, the energy is essentially, I would say, that actually um, trap you in your digestive system or would cause problems with your digestive system one way or another we all do have some digestive issues from time to time but we all do experience these emotions from time to time in programs so we're talking about anger resentment fear guilt hold abuse or abuse currently or an inability to accept yourself or accept love um that's essentially summing up the digestive system for you uh, I'm going to work on a number of things with you. Uh, I'm going to work on the first three chakras uh, with your permission. And if you're part of the program, I'm going to open the base chakra and the second chakra. And I'm just going to command that any old anger or abusive energies be released and be sent to the light, transformed, and your first two chakras open beautifully in balance. And then I'm going to work on your solar plexus, <clears throat> the third chakra. And then I'm going to release some old shame and guilt. Now, it could be your own or it could be collective shame and guilt um, from the solar plexus. So I'm going to release that as well, just to allow the solar plexus to work that wee bit better. Uh, I'm going to do some work on your physical digestive system through the day. And I'm also going to do some downloads for you. Of course, it is a theta healing event, so why not? Eh? The downloads today, um, I had them all lined up but my computer's not playing ball it's a new new MacBook as well and it won't play ball it will not screen share so um i had a lovely picture for you this morning of the digestive system i had all my down downloads all typed up and ready for you but you're just gonna have to get them from me this way uh i'm afraid it's just the way it is perhaps it's mercury being in a retrograde quite possibly uh since it's a planet of communication but what we're going to do is download what love feels like today uh, and once again what it feels like to be loved by the creator by the divine by the sacred whatever you want to call that uh, in your mind just now and also understanding what it feels like to be loved and cherished by source divine creator whatever you choose to call it god god goddess whatever name or label you wished to use, the source, um, where we connect, where we came from, okay, to show you that you're truly loved and cherished. And not only that, that you're able to receive um, love from other people easily and graciously and feel cherished by other people as well. And not only that, uh, furthermore, you're able to cherish yourself and you know how to and you know only when to in the best possible ways and um, downloading what it feels like to really love someone downloading what it feels like to feel completely loved downloading what it is to have an understanding of acceptance what it feels like to be safe protected and completely loved what it feels like to allow to live without allowing others to abuse me and what it feels like to live without others abusing sorry the wasp is distracting me. 
what it feels like to live without allowing others to abuse me and without me abusing others. Also, what it is to live without fear, what it is to live without resentment, what it is to feel completely safe, completely protected, completely secure in every way, what it is to live without guilt as well. Okay, that just about does it. I'm going to go just in case we get another glitch here. Wishing you a great day. I hope you're loving the programme. Uh, please send your love. Give me the thumbs up. Write your comments. Uh, I can certainly see them on YouTube. Um, please do give us a wee thumbs up if you enjoy this. And uh, let YouTube and me know that you're enjoying the content. And have a splendiferous day. I uh, hope you have a marvellous day. I hope the sun shines on all that you do. And love to everyone. And I'll see you again tomorrow morning for another recording. Catch you then. Enjoy the healing. Bye for now.